Hey, what's going on guys? Appreciate you joining me this morning. Highland Springs Soap Company, Tobacco Oud. So Tobacco Oud, obviously. Um, spices, bourbon, and something else. I think there was another note in there. Uh, for me, I've already got it kind of preloaded in my, in my uh, bore here. Uh, it's a very well blended soap. I do get tobacco. I do get oud. Uh, I don't really pick up whiskey or bourbon. You guys know that. Maybe a little bit spice. So it's it's a well blended soap. Notes are what they say they are. So, all right, let's get into it. So, I couldn't really find this at too many places. Uh, Pastors had it. Um, a couple other places did not. You can find it at Highland Springs Soap Company. Pastors had it for 20. Highland Springs Soap Company on their site uh, had it for 19. Um, I don't know if it's not in production any longer. You know, maybe there's just um, a couple left. And so they're just trying to sell out their current stock and then that, that might be it. I don't really don't know. But I also have the matching splash and, and let me tell you, I enjoy this scent. My wife does not. But this, to me, is a, is a, is a pleasant scent. I enjoy it. Uh, this was sent to me by Tim from Tim Shaves. I've used this three or four times already. I don't have too many soaps from Highland Spring Soap Company. But... Um, the ones that I, the ones that I do have, I think Trade Winds and, and maybe something else. Oh, they're, they're very, they're very nice. The lather's nice. The scents are good, so no complaints. Now I am using a bore. I haven't used a bore in a while. That's why I wanted to kind of pull this out, uh, honestly. But I know why. I don't really like using bores now. You can't really, I can't really whip up a great lather with it, you know. It's more of like a painting brush. Definitely need to add a little water in here and then we'll get going. We are going to use the Merca, Merca razor. I've been told that I need to pick up a winning razor from, from the, uh, The company that makes the America Razor. Is it WCS? WCS? WSC? I don't know. Um, I got this razor a very, very long time ago. Probably three, four years ago. So, I don't really remember. We're just pumping water into this because I have a lot of growth, so I want to make sure that we're well hydrated here. Hope everybody's great. Hope everybody had a great weekend. Back to the grindstone. Unfortunately, painting a little water here. I cut grass yesterday. First cut of the season. I know up north you guys are dealing with some severe ice and rain and or well I guess snow, not rain. And down here um, from I, I suppose Texas all the way over, but maybe not, maybe it's just Louisiana over to Florida. Mid to high seventies. Sun shining, <laughs> grass is growing. So, spring is upon us. All right, let's get it. Scent strength on this. Off the tub, roughly four and a half, five maybe. Bump it up a point once lathered. About mid strength, you know. Mid strength or slightly above mid strength, which is perfectly fine for me. Uh, 
it's early. I want to say it's 6.30 or so. Woke up. Showered. Had a little coffee. I don't really eat breakfast. You know, that's something that uh, I've told that to a few people throughout my life. I've never eaten breakfast. Never. And uh, everybody that I've told that to thinks I'm crazy. But I don't know. I just, I'm not like, a, I'm not a breakfast person. Now, if I'm on vacation and I'm getting up at the crack of dawn to go go to a beach or you know whatever then then I may I may eat a little something but my day to day I do not eat breakfast it's just not something I've ever done Second pass. Yeah. <clears throat> oh. Just uh just trucking along. Our soap company has a has an oud scent coming out themselves, ourselves themselves. Talking about myself, my third person. But um, I don't know. I don't know if I want to release it during spring or summer. I'll probably release it either fall or winter. Uh, you know, it's you know, ouds are ouds are kind of musky, and this one definitely is the one that I'm trying to create and. Uh, you know, because of that, I, I just don't think it's it's a heavy it's a heavy darker scent. So I just don't think that it, it would be good for a you know summer or springtime. So yeah, you know, hopefully, hopefully we get it out at the right time and you guys enjoy it. But the newest one that we're going to release is most definitely a spring and summertime scent. And uh, it's kind of hard for me to pick favorites. But of what we've released already, this is probably my favorite scent. Um, the, the one that will be released next. Uh, it's just we, it's not really... It's not really based on anything. It's not really inspired by anything. We're combining multiple FOs and one EO. And, you know, at the end of the day, um, yeah, it, it's just a phenomenal scent. And I think it's going to be great for, uh, for summer. Summer and spring. So yeah, the, the winning razor. Um, I haven't seen. I haven't seen it. Like I've been looking around for it. I'm gonna empty out the sink here. Uh, I've been looking around, but I can't find it anywhere. So I'm assuming it is no longer um, available. I, I don't know. I really, really don't know. I didn't check out any forums or anything like that to see, you know, if it's discontinued or whatnot. But let's go ahead and pull the lather out of this brush. It's kind of a whipped lather. It's, it's and again, this has probably to do with the brush and, and not the actual soap, but 
it's kind of a, like I said, a whipped, a light, foamy, airy. Not super foamy, but a little foamy. Not the lathers that I typically like, but again, I'm using a bore, and the only reason I'm using this is because I haven't used it in a long time. This is the uh, Pro 48, by the way. I don't know if I mentioned that or not. Omega Pro 48. I'm just, I'm just never, I've never gotten the same lathers with a bore that I do with a badger or a synthetic, you know, so. Probably just me though. All right, last pass against the growth and against the growth right here on my neck is actually down. My neck grows so weird. Yeah, I hope you guys and gals up in the north are okay. I know Angelo was doing the Angelo J Mac and, and someone else was doing the uh, uh, the live for TRC with Peter Tarkalis of Ariana and Evans. And I know he, he was doing it from his house. Normally he goes into the razor company and does it, but he was doing it from his house because he was snowed in, I think is, is kind of what it was. And yeah, that's rough. When you can't even leave your house. Mother Nature, man. Mother Nature. She is not to be messed with. She will chew us up and spit us out. And not think twice about it. Very, very nice shave. I don't have my glasses on. I really don't know if I have any weepers or not. Oh, man. Oh yeah, very nice shave. I don't think I missed a single spot. All right, jeez, let me grab something I could uh, dry my face with. I need to get my TRC towels. I don't know. I don't know where they are. Honestly, I know they. I know they were thrown in the washing machine. So I'll kind of my wife will kind of separate. I'll kind of wash and dry. And then she'll kind of fold. Like, that's the... But, um... Yeah, I don't know. Uh, I assume they've been folded. I just have no idea where they're. They're probably in a basket somewhere. Um, Highland Spring Stone Company does, does do plastic uh, bottles. Um, I, I don't... I guess they're cheaper. I don't know. Um... Like I said, synth is very nice. I can't complain about that. But yeah, the uh, the plastic bottles, eh, not for me. I prefer the glass, but you know, others may be different. They may prefer the, the plastic. Oh yeah, there cannot be any alcohol in this. Zero burn, uh, let me see. Rinse my hands off really quick and check it. Yeah, I don't think there's any alcohol. I am getting a little tingling. Uh, might be just frag, as opposed to alcohol though. Let me see, give me one second. Uh, shoot, I was looking for my glasses, they're not in here. Uh, witch hazel, water, aloe. Nope, no alcohol, okay. Yeah, that's kind of what I thought. So the little, the little burn, not burning, the little tingling sensation I'm getting is probably just frag, like a, like a, the mildest case of frag burn, I guess you could call it. Um, not bad at all. Like it's, it's, I mean, so, so minor that I probably shouldn't even be mentioning it, but I am getting it, so I'm going to mention it. 
But uh, yeah, that's it, guys. I I, like I said, I don't have my glasses in here. I can't see um, if I have weepers or not. I do, right here. I did. Uh, yeah. If you have any questions, put them down below. Uh, this coming week, uh, Patriot will be our very first uh, artisan spot from, from the artisan spotlight week. Patriot will be our very first shave from Heritage Hill. Um, I think I have three, uh, I have four soaps from them. We'll probably only be a fit three like I've done for everybody else. Um, and after that, uh, I don't know. I'll have to figure out who I want to do next. So I appreciate you guys watching as always. Have a great day. Have a great night. Uh, have a great week at work or weekend, depending on when you're catching this. I'll see you next time.